deploy models using NVIDIA NIM. And in this video, I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to do it. Now, there is no secret that open source large language models are taking over and beating the closed source models like GPT-4 and many others. However, one of the biggest issues is that deploying is a very cumbersome process. And this gets exacerbated when you're working with large, large language models, with which are multi-billion parameters and multi-gigabyte models. Here comes NVIDIA NIM. This is a way to deploy LLMs in just one or two clicks. You can get access to large language models like Llama 70 billion and many other open source LLMs that have been released and that are going to be released in the near future. This allows you to easily deploy LLMs, which handles scalability by itself. And it is very, very simple to use. So you get to skip the complex part. Now, let's get on with it. So the first thing you guys have to do is go to try now and you will be presented with a sign up page. Once you sign up, you actually get to, get to use this for free. Now from here, as you can see, there are different models that are, that are available right now, which you can use. You can use Google Gemma, you can use Mistral, and new models that are gonna come out, they're gonna put it over here. Now for this use case, we're gonna use a very simple Llama 3 70 billion instruct, which is the most powerful Llama 3 model that's, that is available right now. All you have to do is go to your code editor and we simply write our code. By the way, I make similar videos like these on LLMs, machine learning, and other data science tools. So please feel free to subscribe. Its first thing is you guys have to install OpenAI package. I'm assuming many of you guys have already have that. If not, you can just do a pip install OpenAI and you're good to go. We're going to define the client, which is going to be OpenAI client. And in here, you have to pass in the API key. Now, I've defined my environment op API key over here, which is actually provided from NVIDIA. And we're gonna call this in this file over here. And to do that, we have to load our environment variables. So over here, I've done, I've done load.env, and then we extract the name API key from my environment package over here. And then we pass this variable to our function. And now what we do, we actually get to define which models we can use right now. So essentially we are piggybacking OpenAI functions, but then we're actually passing in the NVIDIA API. So over here, you define your model, so in this case, we have a meta llama 3 70 billion instruct, and then we pass in the messages. So how we want to, or how we want our model to respond. Now, the reason why I'm showing this is because if I can show you guys how to integrate with the open AI function, then you guys can integrate this into your Langchain or Llama index or any other pipelines you guys are using. And then in the content, you can actually ask your question. So over here, give me a brief information about LeBron James. And then you can also define different parameters like temperature, top P, max tokens, and so forth. After we've done that, all we have to do is print out the responses that we get over here. And that's about it. Now we just run our Python file and it should respond with something interesting. And here we go. Here we have a description of LeBron James. We have LeBron Raymond James. I actually didn't know he, his name was actually Raymond. He's from Akron, Ohio. And LeBron James is widely considered one of the greatest basketball players of all time, which I absolutely agree. Now, now that I've pissed off a lot of people in here, I just want to quickly show you guys how to get the API key. Now, there are different models, as I mentioned over here, that you can use. You can use Phi3 Mini. You can even search for Phi3 Medium. And whichever model you choose, you can get the API key from here, generate key, and it's going to generate you guys some key. And then you have your node, your shell, and different ways to use the use various models. Now over here, you can even, they've even provided the Docker configuration. So you can apply it to your application that you guys have. And yeah, that is a quick overview of NVIDIA NIM API. Now they've also promised that you can actually deploy your own models through NVIDIA NIM. However, I believe this just got released a few days ago and they haven't really updated the documentation on how to deploy a model yet. And when it comes out, I'm going to make a video on that. So if you guys found this tutorial useful, please feel free to subscribe. I'm going to make similar videos like these. All right, guys, have a nice day.